Hello, my name is Tom Lodziak. This video, it's all about service and it's aimed specifically at beginner players. Maybe you're someone who, you're just learning to play table tennis and you want to know how to do a few serves. Or maybe you've been playing in a social setting for a while and you already have you know, one serve that you can use, but you want more. Well, this is the video for you. I'm going to show you four basic serves which are easy to learn and they're pretty easy to execute, but they'll still pose a challenge to your opponents. Let's have a look at the first serve. Let's start with a backspin serve. So what's going on here? Well, to do this backspin serve, I've opened up my bat angle. So it's facing up now towards the ceiling. And that allows me to be able to contact the bottom part of the ball. And that's what starts to generate the backspin, okay? So if I can contact the ball there, that's gonna make the ball spin this way, generating a little bit of backspin. With the type of contact I'm making on the ball. I want it to be more of a brushing type contact because that's going to generate more spin. If the contact's too thick, might get a little bit of spin, but if I do a brushing contact, then I'm going to get more spin. Okay, so I toss the ball and as it's falling, I try to chop underneath the ball. Toss, chop underneath the ball. Next, let's look at a topspin serve. So what am I doing here? Well, if this was my backspin serve, what I've done now for the topspin serve, I've just turned the bat angle around this way so that I can now start contacting towards that top part of the ball there. I toss the ball up and as it's falling, play forwards and up this time. The contact that you make on the ball, once again, we want to just try and give that a little bit of a brush, that's gonna generate a little more topspin, okay? So toss the ball as it's falling, try to play forward and up, a little bit of brush, and that's a very basic topspin serve. Now for a side spin serve. So what is happening here? Well, if this is backspin, this is top spin, I'm now trying to get my angle of bat so it's just a little more vertical and that's going to allow me to contact the side of the ball a little bit and that's going to generate the side spin. If we go back to think about our backspin serve, our backspin serve came forwards and down. This top spin serve came forwards and up. With the side spin serve, the swing is going to come across the body more and that's going to allow you to make contact on the ball towards the side and that generates some side spin. So the swing is kind of sideways and forwards, okay? Sideways and forwards. Um, 
With the contact, once again, just trying to brush that ball, that's what generates spin. So, toss as the ball is falling, swing sideways across your body, trying to make contact with the side of the ball. And that's your side spin serve. And the fourth serve we're going to look at is a no spin serve. Okay, why would we do a no spin serve? It doesn't look very effective, does it? Um, I think if all you ever did was a no spin serve, then yeah, your serve probably wouldn't be very good. But when you combine no spin serves with these other spins, then actually it can be quite effective because if your opponent is expecting you to do a spin serve and then you don't put much spin on it, um, it often catches them out and they can often over hit the ball or just pop the ball high up and that gives you a chance just to um, smash the ball. So how do we do a no spin serve? Let's go through the other serves again. Backspin underneath, top spin over the top, side spin round the side. And with the no spin serve, really, we're just gonna go through the back of the ball, okay? We're gonna try and not spin the ball much at all. So it's, it's a pretty flat contact. Um, and when you're doing this, you will put a little bit of spin on the ball, depending exactly where you contact it. But there's just not going to be very much spin on the ball, okay? So we can put that into a category of no spin. Um, and a simple way of doing this, as we saw in the demonstration, toss the ball as it's falling, and this time my bat is just coming pretty straight, hitting through the back of the ball, okay? I'm not trying to spin it this time, not trying to brush it, just trying to hit through the back of the ball. So now you have four different service variations that you can use. And let's look at what's happening. Because I've demonstrated it all from the same position. You've, what you've got now is four serves, which from the starting position, well, it could be any one of the four serves you're going to do. It could be backspin, it could be top spin, it could be side spin, or it could be no spin. So, if your opponent isn't really paying attention, you're going to start catching them out by varying these different spins, just by changing what you do as you approach the ball. Now, the serves that I've shown you in this video, they're very basic, okay? They're not world-class, super-duper serves, but if you're at the beginner level, by learning these four serves, what you're going to be able to learn is how to put different spins on the ball by changing your bat angle and also changing your swing trajectory. And when you've learned how to do this, how to change the spin, how to manipulate the bat angle and the swing trajectory, then I think it becomes so much easier to then develop more advanced serves. You know, keep it simple to begin with. Just get the basics right first, and that's gonna really set you up to be able to develop in the future. Okay, thank you very much for watching. I will have plenty more videos coming soon, so I'll see you then. Bye-bye.